Today on Rack Recordings, I show you how to master metalcore. All right, so here we are back in our session. Well, not really our session, but this is the final mix of the song we worked on last video, mixed down into a WAV file in my mastering section of Studio One. So let's take a listen. First thing we can grab would be spectrum meter. I like to add them in post. So we can really, I know there's one here, I know, but I don't personally like reading that one. So let's see where we're at. All right, so let's, uh, why don't we compress it? So let's use, Joel Wanasek Bus Glue Mix. This is an awesome, awesome plugin because of the no small time button. But this is uh, this is a really cool plugin. So I like to set it to nickel, no small time, and then we will compress it here. So let's see. Um, now we can add maybe a little more gentle compression. So let's do, we'll do Fab Filter Pro C2. Gentle wide mastering, see what that does. Now a nice thing with Fab Filter, they have these little headphones things which basically lets you listen to what you're doing. So let's start over again. All right, let's see what that does. I want to um, not pump. You don't want to make the mix pump and distort. That'll probably do it for compression. So let's just see now. Let's uh, see what happens if I get rid of both of these and I'll add them back in. Let's see if we could uh, tighten up the low end, see what this does, so. All right, so that was cool. That's basically, uh, it's only compressing that frequency band, keeping the low end more tight and under control. Fab filter Saturn. There's a thing on here called Magic Mastering. I really enjoy it. So for right now, we will keep it off.
All right, so let's throw a limiter on and see what happens here. So let's start with something metal, metal, potentially loud as fuck. Okay, well, why not? See what this does. So now you notice that the slope of our song is actually following the slope that it says to. So there we go. So now we have a nice, loud, modern metalcore song file to post online. It's right in the perfect loudness to not be part of the loudness war, but it's, uh, it's there. So one more listen here. And there we go. All right. Like I said in the last video, if you enjoyed what you saw, please subscribe to my channel. I have drum samples available for purchase. They will be in the video description below. So in the comments, let me know what you thought of this little two-part series that I'm doing. Uh, I could do more of these, kind of enjoy them, to be honest with you. So yeah. So like always, thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.